welcome back to my channel. This is Rhonda. Um, please like and subscribe down below and turn on the bell notification to get notifications when I post. Um, today, I will be showing you guys how I do my eyebrows. Now, I'm no professional, so don't take it as I messed you up. If you decide to try this way, awesome. If not, then I mean everything... I mean, a lot of things work differently for everyone, so, yeah. Um, yeah, so, I was asked by uh, one of my Instagram followers to show you guys how I do my eyebrows. So, um, first, uh, you have to get out everything that you need. Um, I have my primer. I have my spoolie. It is very useful to get a spoolie when you are doing your eyebrows because mine are wild. So I have to, you know, brush them and everything just to get them to go right. Um, now, this next one, I know it's not a makeup brush, so don't judge me. I already know it's not a makeup brush. It's just, it's easier for me to use um, this paint brush here because as you can see it is very like small on the tip or whatever so it makes it like useful for like the brush strokes and stuff on the inside of the brow um hello I have my stuff for my eyebrows I know this is eyeliner but it's in um it's in this brown shade so I like to use it um, and then on top of it has, like, a few sparkles in it, so, yeah, um, cause the original brow stuff that I used, it was not, uh, working properly anymore, cause I don't know how it dried out, but it did, I, it had a top of it, so I don't know, and then I have this, now I know this concealer is lighter than my skin, but I use it because it gives, um, it makes my under eye light enough, so I, well it makes <laughs> under my brow light enough so I can go ahead and like add the colors and the colors pop and stuff like that so that's why I use this um but yeah that's mostly what I use so forgive me when I take these glasses off because I am blind so I'm gonna be using this mirror I do not have 20 vision like everyone else uh yeah I wish I could learn how to do them with my glasses on but I can't so yeah, I'm not going to really be looking at the camera much because I can't see. Uh, my, I'm using my phone, so it's like sideways. That's why it's like it looks like I'm looking over here. Well, when I'm looking at the phone, but like the camera's on this side. So, yeah. Okay, so first off, we're going to do is uh, brush your eyebrows out. Now, my eyebrows are weird because one of, like this one's like a natural arch, and then this one's just kind of like slapped on the face. Um, but recently my mom helped me, uh, yeah, recently my mom helped me arch my eyebrows. Okay, so I brushed up my eyebrows, and then I'm only gonna apply, like, a dot of primer. Just a dot. I mean, a lot of people be like, this is weird, why the fuck are you priming your eyebrows? My face is weird. So... And this is Master Prime by Maybelline. I got that from my mom. Like, I would prime, like, my whole eyelid, but since I'm not doing, like, a full makeup look today, uh, I won't be uh, doing that. So, eyebrows are primed and ready to go. Um, let's see. Okay, I got my... Brush and just dip it in here. Get a good amount of product. Don't put too much on it because then it'll be like, oh, that's too much. And then your eyebrows will be looking like you yeah, drew mom a sharpie. Okay, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start the bottom and outline that. 
and make sure make sure it's straight because you never want a crooked eyebrow. Um, yes. So I'm gonna outline the bottom, and then okay. So when I outline the top of my eyebrows, it's kind of a funny situation because I have like this patch up here. It's the arch of my eyebrow, but it's like there's it looks like there's no hair in there. So it's like really light for some reason. So I'm going to start from there and draw the tail of the eyebrow and then I go and line the top of the eyebrow making sure it connects with the tail. I, mean, I don't know if you can tell or not but yeah that's the process right now. Let's see that it's good. Make it easy for you guys. But yeah so uh, outline the top to connect. Make sure that the, the um point right here that you're doing is not too sharp because then it'll be like, why? Um, my eyebrows have like a funny shape to them. I don't know why. I was just born with them like that. So excuse the outlining shape. It's weird. I know. And then what I do is I go ahead and Fill in the tail of the eyebrow, and then when I got, start to get to the outer, I'm gonna do this this little motion where it's like a flick to get it to go. Cause you know you not you don't want too much up here. So I flick it going up, like making strokes for hair. So it just kind of fills it in without um, making it too much. Uh, and then I'm going to take the spoolie and kind of, you know, work it in to the brow. And don't worry if you mess up. That's what the concealer for is to uh, the concealers to, you know, cut and clean up the mess and stuff like that. So I'm just gonna add a tear bit more. And then you're just gonna keep going back and forth between the applicating. Yeah, the applying and going back and forth between spooling and yet. Because like right now you can definitely see the difference between this eyebrow and this eyebrow. I have an eyebrow uh, here. Uh, I'm not making it too thick. I'm like literally going along the edges of my eyebrow when I outline them and fill them in. And this, like, over here, it looks, I don't know why, like, the outer part of my eyebrows always look, like, super thin, and you can't really see them. So, that goes. And then, I take, I don't really like going above the eyebrow with highlighter, um, I mean, not highlight, with co uh, concealer, unless I'm putting foundation over it. So, I don't really bother with that, because then you get, like, this little halo effect type shit going on. Uh, so what I do is I go and I apply it underneath. Uh, usually I would use um, a smaller brush to do that, but I couldn't find it before I made this video. So yeah, and then you take it and you like kind of pull it down so it don't be looking like that. You don't want it looking like that. So you just take a brush and you like swipe it down. And make sure that you know you clean it up. And if you mess up somewhere, it's okay. You can always go and like retouch it up. Go ahead and clean it 
know it's okay if you get it like going out here and in here and stuff we're gonna cover all that with like foundation and stuff and if you don't wear foundation you could just like get a q-tip or some vaseline and stuff and just kind of rub it there and like wipe it away uh with tissue or something it'll get rid of it And you see, it just kind of cuts it, makes it look good. Like I'm going to go ahead and do the other brow off camera, and then I'll come back to you. Okay, so I am back uh, with the other eyebrow done and completed. Um, I know at some angles it'll look like I don't have eyebrows, but that's because I only have this white right here. Um, but yeah, went from no brows to having eyebrows. Uh... But anyway, uh, yes, that would be how, yeah. So this is like what it looks like after I'm done. Um, like I said, I am no pro. I just, I'm like self-taught at doing makeup. So I do my best. Uh, but yes, that would be the, um, <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to try that. Uh, yeah. Yeah. But that would be the video. So uh, I hope you like. Please remember to like, subscribe, and turn on the bell notifications for every time I post. Uh, if you have any ideas of the next makeup video that you want to see, please let me know down in the comments. I am up for doing bold eye looks, simple eye looks. You know, those sweet kind of looks. And um, good. I like, I, I like doing fierce looks as well. I always feel like I look better at that, and then I'm, I'm always like wearing matte lipstick because I love matte lipstick. But um, I don't know why my camera is doing that. Um, yes, please like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you in the next video. Later, mini bots.